Hi, uh, welcome to Gotham TV. My name is Peter Schneider. Um, uh, I'm excited to talk about the Cedar DNS2. Uh, this is a uh, product that we saw at NAB and um, uh, we're going to show some demo videos. Uh, we're going to play with some of the settings, um, talk about some of the use case scenarios. Um, and hopefully um, all of you folks that are watching uh, in Cyberland will chime in with questions. Um, so I think first we'll sort of do a uh, like a 10,000 foot pass at, at this and we'll sort of talk about um, what is the Cedar DNS2 and what is so exciting about it. Um, the Cedar technology has been around for many, many years. It started um, as hardware um, that was designed for noise reduction, um, that it could um, analyze incoming audio signals um, and analyze the n what we as humans consider the noise in that incoming uh, signal and uh, reduce it. Um, I remember when they were, uh, you know, very uh, large, um, they were AC only, um, they had a lot of controls for a lot of tweaking, um, and even um, as they became software-based um, or had a software-based option, um, they uh, were not what uh, I would call location-friendly, I think is, is fair to say. Um, they were great for post-production, um, but, but um, not location-friendly um, in the way that as location sound mixers we need, the, we need them to be. Um, so at NAB this past April, um, we saw this incredible device, this um, DNS2, um, and it had been shrunk down. It had been made location friendly by such options as um, the uh, uh, 12 volt power input. Um, and it has a number of other um, sort of features that are location friendly. I don't know if we can see here. I don't have a tally monitor, but. Um, well, anyways, on the left-hand side, it's all plugged in right now, so I don't want to quite destroy what we've done, but on the left-hand side are a pair of analog inputs, um, as well as um, digital inputs, um, and, and a digital output, and we have analog outputs and um, power, digital output and power on the right-hand side. Um, it's very small, very location-friendly. Um, on the front are a series of simplified controls. Um, so we have uh, power, um, and there's our, our sort of uh, setup button, which gets us into a number of different parameters, um, which I'll go through in a few minutes, um, as well as um, uh, our dynamic noise reduction on and off. That's what actually, um, it's effectively like a bypass signal. Um, and a learn uh, function, which we'll get into, as well as an encoder knob. And you have one for each uh, input. You, the inputs can act together or they can act independently. Um, so yeah, completely, um, you know, about as location friendly as you can get. Um, in a bag, you would um, bring one or two tracks into it, and I think there's um, merits for bringing um, both boom and radio mic into it and then you can come either analog out or digital out. Um, in our case, like I said, we're going digital into it just because of our workflow that we want to show you. Um, and so what we're going to do today is we are going to um, show a video that we shot. Um, it's our own Adam Goodman uh, reading what I really hope is going to be considered fair use. Uh, uh, <laughs> from a, a script which you may or may not recognize. Um, uh, and uh, anyways, uh, we figured we'd, we'd take him to the noisiest locations that we could think of, which is around Times Square in New York City. Um, and we recorded him with a boom and a wireless track. Um, Will, who is behind the camera, is going to um, run the audio mix. Um, and so we'll call out for various um, tracks and, and we'll um, together sort of operate the DNS and, and see what it can do. Um, and uh, I should also mention after 
the broadcast um, will be putting up all of these source files um, online. So um, I think the first thing uh, we'll do, and I'm just checking to see if there's any questions, chime in. I, I have a little iPad here. I can look and see if anybody has questions. I'll get to them. Um, uh, the first thing uh, I think we'll do is let's take a look at the raw video. And Will, so what are people listening to? Are they listening to a mono mix of boom and wireless? Um, all right, so let, let's do that. The sort of 50-50 mix, right? All right, so let's see if we can do this. Uh, open with QuickTime. All right, and I... Uh-huh. There we go. I have a Windows keyboard on a Mac computer. Always fun. All right, so let's um, let's watch and have a listen. Uh, this is a condensed version of the video that we'll be seeing, but it's the raw, unprocessed tracks. Yes, um, Cedar is off is is in bypass. Hi, I'm Adam. I'm part of the sales team at Gotham Sound. We're here in Times Square, uh, greeting some excellent quotes from the Star Wars prequels. You used to think you said people gonna die. I don't care what universe you're from, that's got to hurt. Ugh, so uncivilized. Now this is pod racing. So this is how Liberty dies, with thunderous applause. For reasons we can't explain, we are losing her. He said you killed younglings. Well then you really are lost. What if the democracy we thought we were serving no longer exists, and the Republic has become the very evil we have been fighting to destroy? Train yourself to let go of everything you fear to lose. Miss you I shall, Chewbacca. Around the survivors, a perimeter create. Uh, cool. I <laughs> think it's uh, uh, very cool. So we saw four use case scenarios, four uh, locations. Uh, crowd, traffic, generator, train. Um, let's, um, let's watch that one more time, Will, but let's um, listen to just the lav. Just because I think, to be fair, if you were shooting in noisy locations, um, that would be sort of your first go-to, um, you know, way to reduce noise. Um, so we'll do. We'll listen one more time. Everybody, everybody, cool with this? Anybody have any questions? Nope. All right. So we're gonna watch um, one more time. Just love. Here we go. Hi, I'm Adam. I'm part of the sales team at Gotham Sound. We're here in Times Square, uh, greeting some excellent quotes from the Star Wars prequels. You used to think you said people gonna die? I don't care what universe you're from, that's got to hurt. Ugh, so uncivilized. Now this is pod racing. So this is how Liberty dies, with thunderous applause. For reasons we can't explain, we are losing her. He said you killed younglings. Well then you really are lost. What if the democracy we thought we were serving no longer exists, and the Republic has become the very evil we have been fighting to destroy? Train yourself to let go of everything you fear to lose. Miss you I shall, Chewbacca. Around the survivors, a perimeter create. All right. Uh, perfect. Okay. Um, so let's get into it. Um, now, we are using this um, post-production, right? Um, but the idea for this is that you would use it in production. Um, so there's a little bit of a cheat going on. Um, it would have been a little tricky to sort of take this show into the middle of Times Square and use it dynamically. So we're going to pretend um, that these are live tracks coming in. Um, but in order to sort of see what's going on, um, uh, we're, we're going to control things using uh, Reaper. Um, and we are going to feed it in um, one track at a time. So the way we've set this up um, with uh, the Cedar is on the left, our track input one is uh, boom, is that right? Correct. And um, input two is wireless. So let's start with the worst case scenario. Um, and we'll go um, location by location. So we'll alternate between um, you know, one pass reducing the noise on the boom, one pass reducing the noise on the wireless. Do you want both up? Or? Um, I think let's do it one at a time. I think. Um, I think to be fair, um, although if this were a narrative and we, and we were trying to be fancy with it and we'd have a mix of boom and wireless, I think if we were, if we were really shooting out here, 
Um, we would just be using the wireless, but let's let's see what we can do with both. Um, but for for we'll take in other words, we'll take it just boom or just wireless. Um, all right. So starting with just boom, um, the first thing I want to do is I want to um, get the cedar to learn the noise. So if we um, switch over to my desktop, um, let's kind of move. Whoops. Let's move our um, playhead all the way over. Let's listen and let's listen for some noise. And and uh, the video window will be here. And and so this is a longer um, version of what we just saw. And right. You used to think you of people gonna die? I don't care what universe you're from. That's got to hurt. Love won't save you, Padme. Only my new powers can do that. Don't try it, Anakin. I have the high ground. There's always a bigger fish. I'm haunted by the kiss you should never have given me. Uh, okay, so, you know, it's interesting. I've, uh, I've been going through the manual. Um, it doesn't explicitly say on the learn, um, for the learn function, that um, you should only highlight noise. So let's just see what happens, uh, which is, by the way, that's how I'm used to a lot of these plugins working, where you only feed it noise. It, so it says, and I'll read it from it, use the learn buttons to control whether the noise detector in the DNS uh, to adapts continuously to the audio signal. Switching the learn off freezes the noise detector, and the noise detector is reset when the learn is switched back on. Um, yeah, uh, so there's no other mention of um, you know only feeding it noise. I think if I were using this in the field, I would effectively feed the learn function room tone um, or just ambience, just the open mic um, with, without anybody speaking. And we can simulate that here. So let's try it two ways. I guess this is going to, we're going we're gonna to be here a while. I hope everybody, we're <laughs> strap in everybody. Uh, all right. Um, so let's try it. I'm going to put learn on. Um, and we're still hearing the raw, um, the raw boom. And go. Don't try it, Anakin. I have the high ground. There's always a bigger fish. I'm haunted by the kiss you should never have given me. Are you an angel? I don't like sand. It's coarse and rough and irritating, and it gets everywhere. Okay, and I'm going to disengage the learn function, and now we're going to start to, um, we're going to start to play. So let me just zoom out a little bit so that I can get all the way back to the beginning. There we go. Uh, okay, so we have two controls here. Um, the first control is my attenuation, and that's sort of the default um, control. I don't know, can you guys, can you guys see that? Next, should I be left-handed about it? Yeah. All right, well, <laughs> here, I'll try this. Uh, anyways, we're looking at that movement right there, right? And so there's two controls. One is attenuation, and the other is um, bias. And so rather than me try and um, sort of summarize what the manual says, it's brief, the manual's brief enough um, that uh, I can just read from it, which is, um, so attenuation is um, the amount of noise attenuation that it's going to uh, it's going to um, uh, reduce. The default action of each encoder is to uh, adjust the amount of noise attenuation applied to the signal um, as shown on the left hand side of the display. That's fair enough. Bias is a little bit more funny. Um, bias, uh, it says the encoder also provides control of the bias, which is shown on the right hand half of the display. We click the encoder back and forth like that to switch between the two. Here, I'll try that again. You can see. Um, the bias is a center zero control, and the fader shows the current position. Raise the bias to increase the amount of noise detected. This will allow the process to remove more noise, but may lead to compression of wanted audio and make the signal sound dry. Uh, lower the bias to decrease the amount of noise detected. Um, this will allow the process to retain more atmos, but will remove less noise. Uh, the right-hand bar graph shows the detected long-term signal-to-noise ratio. Uh, the solid bar shows the detected noise level, and the shaded bar shows the detected long-term signal level. Um, consequently, the difference between the heights of the solid and shaded bars indicate the long-term signal-to-noise ratio. So let's take a look and see how this plays out. I am um, going to 
uh, engage the noise reduction, and let's just have a listen and start to uh, start to make adjustments. You used to think you of people gonna die? I don't care what universe you're from. That's got to hurt. Love won't save you, Padme. Only my new powers can do that. Don't try it, Anakin. I have the high ground. There's always a bigger fish. I'm haunted by the kiss you should never have given me. Are you an angel? I don't like sand. So it's core. Let's listen. Let's listen to the differences. Uh, so this is no noise reduction. Used to think you of people gonna die? I don't care what and universe you're is, from. That's um, got to hurt. This is love won't with save you, Padme. Only my new powers can do that. Don't try it, Anakin. I have the high ground. What do we think? It sounds like it's cutting into the voice a little bit too much. So let's uh, let's keep playing. Used to think you of people gonna die? I don't care what universe you're from. That's got to hurt. Love won't save you, Padme. Only my new powers can do that. Don't try it, Anakin. I have the high ground. There's always a bigger fish. I'm haunted by the kiss you should never have given me. That's Are you an angel? Pretty good, I think. I don't like sand. It's coarse and rough and irritating, and it gets everywhere. Annie, my goodness, you've grown. How wooed. I've been wondering. Uh, yeah, I mean, so it, it clearly gets rid of that sort of whooshing sound, which is just the general gack from Times Square. Um, it doesn't get rid of the voices in the background, um, because how can it? It's trying to keep the voice in the foreground. Um, and I think it's a good, this is a good jumping off point um, to sort of talk about um, the use of this tool. Um, uh, I think that this tool does not replace post-production sound editing and mixing. Um, I think that this tool um, allows one to uh, reduce some background noise on location. Um, and I think that it, um, uh, it's useful particularly when there is limited post-production sound work. Um, for example, live broadcasts or live to tape. Um, you know, I've shot in studios that were very, very noisy, where the, the grid was noisy. Um, and this would have been great, because on the, sh on the show that I worked on, um, there was minimal post-production sound work done. Um, so to just have this permanently in the signal chain um, would have been fantastic. Um, all right, so that's, um, I think it doesn't get more simple than that. And we can tweak into that. So um, I think. Let's um, do the same thing with just the radio mic. And then we're going to go back um, and we're going to um, you know, really see if just feeding it a noise signal, like room tone, like my original idea, would make a difference. And then we'll sort of go a little bit faster through the rest of the clips. Um, all right. So uh, and, and really, I think what I'll do is I'll skip ahead to the generator. Um, because that's, for me, that's such a typical use case scenario. Mm -hmm. Um, but let's, you know, we're getting our feet wet, so let's see what we can do. All right, so we're switching to the, um, just the radio mic. Now, is, is it going to come in on input two? Let's try it. Yes. Okay. Um, you used to think you of people going to oh, die? No, it's, still, it's still input one. I don't care what it's universe you're from. One. That's got to hurt. Love right. won't save you, Padme. Only my new power. All right, that's good. Uh, let's, let's listen. You used to think you of people going to die? I don't care what universe you're from. That's got to hurt. Love won't save you, Padme. Only my new powers can do that. So don't try it, Anakin. I have the high ground. There's always a bigger fish. I'm haunted by the kiss you should never have given interestingly, me. Interestingly, um, are you an angel? I don't like sand. Mic has it's coarse much less and rough English and irritating, and it gets everywhere. So let's attenuate as much as we can. Annie, my goodness, you've grown. How wooed. I've been wondering. What are metachlorians? I have the power. Unlimited power. Ugh, so uncivilized. Now this is pod racing. So this is how liberty dies, with thunderous applause. It is only natural. He cut off your arm. You used to think you of people gonna die? I don't care what universe you're from. That's got to hurt. Try relearning. Used to think you of people gonna die? I don't care what universe you're from. That's got to hurt. 
Love won't save you, Padme. Only my new powers can do that. Don't try it, Anakin. I have the high ground. There's always a bigger fish. So let's, um, let's see if we can make it any better. You used to think you said people gonna die? I don't care what universe you're from. That's got to hurt. Love won't save you, Padme. Only my new powers can do that. Don't try it, Anakin. I have the high ground. There's always a bigger fish. I'm haunted by the kiss you should never have given me. Are you an angel? You used to think you said people gonna- Okay, it is coming in on two. Sorry about that. Yeah, yeah, sorry. You're not crazy, I'm crazy. Uh, all right, let's try this. You used to think you said people gonna die? I don't care what universe you're from. That's got to hurt. Love won't save you, Padme. Only my new powers can- What's that? Sure. Everyone, sure. Sure. Um, sure. Can I, can I just do the radio mic first? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Okay. Um, Left hand. Oh, sorry. Well, all right. Yeah. This is a little bit tricky. All right, you so this think is you said people are going to die? I don't care what universe you're from. That's got to hurt. Love won't save you, Padme. Only my new powers can do that. Don't try it, Anakin. Okay. I have the so high. Now let's listen to what it does. You said think you said people are going to die? I don't care what universe you're from. That's got to hurt. Love won't save you, Padme. Only my new powers can do that. Don't try it, Anakin. I have the high ground. There's always a bigger fish. I'm haunted by the kiss you should never have given me. Are you an angel? I don't like sand. It's coarse and rough and irritating, and it gets everywhere. Wow. So that makes a pretty big difference. So this is radio mic unprocessed. Bigger fish. I'm haunted by the kiss you should never have given me. Are you an angel? And this is processed. I don't like sand. It's coarse and rough and irritating, and it gets everywhere. So it cuts into the voice. Annie, my goodness, you've grown. And we How can change rude. that. I've been wondering, what are metachlorians? I have the power. Unlimited power. Ugh. I think that's pretty good. Uh, all right, so now that we got the hang of this, let's move on to the generator one. Uh, okay, so let's hear generator boom, and I'll skip ahead to the generator. Uh, so this is unprocessed boom. Reasons we can't explain, we are losing her. He said you killed younglings. Well, then you really are lost. Okay, so pretty gnarly, so let's see what it does. Uh, all right, so... Uh, we will have it learn. Reasons we can't explain, we are losing her. He said you killed younglings. Well, then you really are lost. What if the democracy... Okay. And let's see what we can do just by having it engaged. Reasons we can't explain, we are losing her. All right, so that's a little bit too he much. He said you killed younglings. Well, then you really are lost. What if the um, democracy we thought we were serving no longer exists? Raising the and the Republic attenuation. has become the very evil we have been fighting to destroy. I have waited a long time for this moment, my little green friend. I'll try spinning, that's a good trick. You were banished because you were clumsy. You are in my very soul tormenting me. At an end your rule is, and not short enough it was. So let's listen to it without any uh, noise reduction. Reasons we can't explain, we are losing her. And with he noise reduction. He said you killed younglings. Well then you really are lost. What if the democracy... I wonder if we feed it just generator and have it learn just what the generator is. So let's see if we can find a nice chunk. Reasons we can't explain, we are losing her. There's a nice chunk right in there. So I'm going to loop play this. Uh, there we go. This doesn't have to quite be so big. Can get rid of that. No. There we go. Okay. Uh, so this is going to be just the reasons we can't explain. We are just the generator her. noise. And we will have it learn this. Okay, so now let's see if just changing the noise profile makes a difference. 
So this is no noise reduction. Reasons we can't explain, and we are losing noise her. Reduction. He said you killed younglings. Now let's well, see then if we you can really are lost. It. What if the democracy we thought we were serving no longer exists, and the Republic has become the very evil we have been fighting to destroy? I have waited a long time for this moment, my little green friend. I'll try spinning, that's a good trick. You were banished because you were clumsy. You are in my very soul tormenting me. At an end your rule is, and Without? not short enough it was. You being around her again is, oh, Look. just being around her again, intoxicating. Your oh. new empire, they live inside me? Your presence is soothing. Oh my god. That's... Reasons we can't explain, we are losing her. He said you killed younglings. Well then you really are lost. And this is the unprocessed. What if the democracy we thought we were serving no longer exists? Processed. And the Republic has become the very evil we have been Un fighting to destroy. Unprocessed. I have waited a long so, time I mean, for this moment, it's, it's my little voice green it's friend. Hard to find a, a I'll try spinning. Um, let's move on to um, the uh, the wireless mic. Yep. All right. So here we go. We'll go back to our loop. Reasons we can't explain. Reasons we can't explain. We'll we are losing her. And take it off loop. Reasons we can't explain, we and are losing her. this is noise reduction in. He said you killed younglings. Well, then you really are lost. What if the democracy we thought we were serving no longer exists, and the Republic has become the very evil we have been fighting to destroy? I have waited a long time for this moment, my little green friend. I'll try spinning, that's a good trick. You were banished because you were clumsy. You are in my and very soul, tormenting no noise me. noise reduction. At an end, your rule is, and not short enough it was. Not too you dramatic, but I think there's enough there, um, that there's enough noise reduction there to warrant it. Um, again, it's interesting. I'm curious to know if we just let it play and learn at the same time what happens. Long time for this moment, my little green friend. I'll try spinning, that's a good trick. You were banished because you were clumsy. You are in my very soul, tormenting me. Because here it is without processing. At an end, processing. your rule is, and not short enough it was. You being around her again is, oh, just being around her so again, with processing, intoxicating. Without processing. Your new empire, they live inside me? Your presence is soothing. Oh my god, you don't want to sell me death sticks? It's kind of amazing, actually. <laughs> wow. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm impressed. Uh, I guess at some point you take it off learn when you sort of have where it's gotten a profile, but yeah. Um, all right, so should we try the train? Uh, any, any questions, any comments? Anybody actually watching, 11 people? All right, good. Um, 10 of them are at the office, I guess. Um, all right, so here's the train. Uh, let's do train, um, let's just do train uh, wireless mic. Let's stay on the wireless mic. All right, so I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to engage the um, noise reduction, and I'll engage the learn function, and we'll just let it figure it out on its own. <laughs> Henceforth, you shall be known as Darth Vader. If into the security recordings you go, only pain you will find. His cells have the highest concentration of metachlorians I have ever seen in a life form. This is the end for you, my master. All right, so let's play. So uh, um, uh, I don't know which ones I haven't. It's learned. It's learned it already. Um, let's uh, see if we can tweak the settings to make it sound a little bit more natural. So I'll let it play. <laughs> Henceforth, you shall be known as Darth Vader. I'm gonna adjust the bias. If into the security recordings you go, only pain you will find. His cells have the highest concentration of metachlorians I have ever seen in a life form. This is the end for you, my master. Uh, uh, I don't know which ones I haven't read yet. Train yourself to let go of everything you fear to lose. Okay, so starting from the beginning, this is without noise reduction. <laughs> Henceforth, you shall be known as Darth Vader. 
If into the security recordings you go, only pain you will find. His cells have the highest concentration of metachlorians I have ever seen Adjust in a life form. A little bit. This is the end for you, my master. Uh, uh, I don't know what... Let's try one more time. <laughs> Henceforth you shall be known With as Darth Vader. If into the security recordings you go, only pain you will find. His Without cells have reduction. the highest concentration That's, of metachlorians uh, I, I have ever spot. seen in a life form. So this is no noise reduction. This is the end for you, my master. Uh, with noise reduction. I, I think, you know, it's interesting. It's, it's tricky to find a balance, I have to say, um, to really kind of um, find it so where you're not eating into the voice. I think that that's one of the um, Limitations. I mean, look, all gear has limitations. So, you know, with this, I think you really need a rehearsal time um, to sort of get the settings right. And you're always trying to eliminate um, the most amount of noise, but the, um, yeah, eliminate the most amount of noise without eliminating the signal, um, which is the voice. So, um, yeah, I really think this is a great tool. I don't think it replaces um, a proper sound editing session or sound mixing session. Um, but I think it definitely has its uses. Um, yeah, so anybody have any questions or comments? Um, yeah, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, I think we're going to wrap it up. So next week, uh, we have Frank Duca in the studio. Frank is an amazing sound mixer, done a lot of live sound. I'm actually kind of curious to see what he thinks of this. Um, worked for Saturday Night Live and, and um, all works for Saturday Night Live and, and uh, Access, Hollywood. Access Hollywood, that's right. Um, uh, anyways, that's Tuesday, July 19th. Follow us on Facebook and Twitter. Archives are at Vimeo and YouTube and please send ideas to us. Uh, info at GothamSound.com. Thanks. <laughs>